Hey everyone, so as you can see, I already started on the first eye. So moving on to the second eye, I am taking a black eyeliner pencil and I'm just going to run this all over my lid. It's going to look a little scary at first, but trust me, it'll work out. So just smudge this all over your lid as a base for the shadow to stick to, but make sure you stay low. And then going in with a flat synthetic brush, I'm just going to start blending this out from the lash line up to the crease. And again, this doesn't have to be too perfect. This is just a base for our shadow to stick to. So just blend it out until you have a rough base to work with. And the reason I'm starting with my eyes first today is just because I'm waiting on a package in the mail with face products that I want to use today. And it has not come yet, so I am just killing time, hoping that it comes. For today's look, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Naked Smoky Palette, and I'm starting with the shade Black Market, and I'm just going to apply that all over my lid where I applied that liner. Again, it doesn't have to be too perfect because we will go in and blend it out, so just make sure you get that initial packing on your lid. Then going in with a small blending brush and nothing on it, I'm going to start working that into the crease, kind of blending out the edges. And then we'll go back in and blend it some more here in a second. This is just the rough initial blending to start working that product into the crease. Then with that same brush in the color Password, I'm just going to further blend that into the crease and kind of above the crease. As you can see on the outer corner, I'm kind of working it up and out just to create the shape that I want. Then going in with a fluffier brush in the shade Combust, I'm just going to lightly blend along the edges so it doesn't get too dark too high. And then I'm applying the shade 13 under my brow for a bit of a highlight. Okay, so my package still hasn't arrived, so I'm just going to go ahead and do my pop lashes. And I'm applying some mascara. This is the Jelly Pom Pom. I got it in one of my Ipsy packages, and I've never heard of it before, and I've never used it, so I figured I might as well try it. And for lashes, I'm using the House of Lashes in the Style Iconic. And after that, my package still hadn't arrived, so... So my package finally arrived, and these are the two babies that I have been waiting for. First up is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation Stick, and I'm just going to put a line across my chin, two lines on each cheek, and I'm going to spray my brush with a little bit of Fix Plus just because this is a really thick foundation, so it'll help blend it out a little bit. And then I'm also going to put a line across my forehead.
Then I'm going in with a NYX Dark Circle Corrector Concealer, and I'm just going to place this only where I have darkness, not all under my eyes as you would with a normal concealer. This is just going to correct any discoloration you have of dark circles underneath your eyes. And then I will go in and blend that out with a damp sponge from Real Techniques. Then for my regular concealer, I'm using the Urban Decay Naked Skin uh, Weightless Concealer, I think it's called. And I'm just going to put that in all the usual places, triangles under my eyes, center of my forehead, down my nose, around my nose, and a little bit on my chin and cupid's bow. And again, blending it out with a damp sponge. Then up next is the second item in the package that I was waiting for, and this is the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. As you can see, I'm super excited to try this. I've been hearing about it all over YouTube, and I finally got my hands on it. So I'm just going to pat underneath my eyes again to make sure you really get out all the creases. And then I'm just going to set underneath my eyes and the rest of the center of my face where I put that concealer. And I'm also going to use it on a brush to set my entire face. I'm going to go do my brows off camera and be right back. And here I am. I am lining my upper and lower waterline with that same black pencil that I use as a shadow base. Then taking a flat definer brush and the black market shade, I'm going to press that into my lower lash line. And then taking a small fluffy brush, I'm going to take that shade of Password and just blend it out. Then for bronzer, I'm taking the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer, and this literally smells like chocolate. It smells so good. And I'm going to put that in all the usual places, nothing new here, all over my cheeks, around the sides of my forehead, jawline, and a little bit on the sides of my nose. Then taking a flat chisel brush and some more of that translucent powder, I'm just going to pack that underneath my contour just to sharpen it, and I'm just going to let that sit while I do the rest of my face. And for blush, I'm using this shade from ColourPop called Between the Sheets, and I'm just going to dust that on my cheeks above where I just put that bronzer. Then for highlight, I'm taking this shade from the Kelly Bible Palette and I'm popping that on the tops of my cheeks, down the center of my nose, and my cupid's bow. Then I'm just going to brush away that powder beneath my contour. Next, I'm applying mascara to my lower lashes, and I'm using the L'Oreal Telescopic, and I really like this one for lower lash mascara because the brush is so small and it really helps you apply it without making a mess. Moving on to lips, I'm going to be lining in Thor from MAC. Then for lipstick, I'm going to be using Whirl, also from MAC. And after that, this look is complete. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you did. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!